दिस होप यू आर डूइंग गुड एंड इन्जॉइंग अ लाइफ आज मैं आपको टुडे आई एम गोइंग गोइंग टू शेयर हाउ यू कैन ट्राई माइक्रोसॉफ्ट इन ट्यून फॉर फ्री राइट यू नो दिस इज एक्चुअली वेरी इम्पॉर्टेंट फॉर एनी ऑर्गेनाइजन टू जस्ट साइन अप फॉर थर्टी डेज ट्रायल पीरियड एंड देन टेस्ट इट एंड देन यू कैन एक्सटेंड राइट सो this actually uh this uh, this uh, this microsoft intune is uh, one of the most uh, uh the most uh, modern platform available to man is all our endpoints like uh, windows 10 uh mobile devices whether it's ios or android or mac operating system okay so in this quick video i i am going to show you how you can create a free subscriptions to try in tune in a test environment right so as you can see uh, my screen here right so i have opened this microsoft uh, link so you can just type this url uh, uh, in in any of the web browser and just open this link and here you will find uh intune actually provide there is a two way uh, to manage the the endpoints right there is one you can see the mobile device management and one is application uh mobile application which is called mam right uh so uh why these two earlier maybe you have seen one the mobile device management why application management i will show you i will uh so you in in the in our next video otherwise the it you will get conf- confused with this right so the prerequisite is uh, to sign up for the microsoft intune um uh, intune is to oh, you you need to have the supported operating system in browser of course and the network access right that's it so uh, is intune is a 30 days uh, uh trial license and if you already have your company or school account you can sign with that account and add into into your subscriptions otherwise you can just sign up for a new account to use into in for your organizations right and the important thing you can't combine your any existing account after you sign up right so let's get started right so <clears throat> you what you have to do its uh, its steps are mentioned here so i will show you so you can just navigate to the account page uh, let me open in another tab it will uh, open here okay you see let's get started right so i have since i have already signed in with my uh, uh, account so you see microsoft intune trial start your free one month trial today okay so i can log out and create new instead which i actually uh, i don't know it say your account already existing with another microsoft service continue purchase microsoft trial for your organizations so if i click on continue right so what will happen we'll see or i can log out and sign in again right so let's uh, i think we should wait for for few minutes okay or 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 you can just as soon as you hit this page right so you it will ask you to enter the email address and click next and if you already have an account with the another uh, microsoft service right you can choose and that, that this is what we have seen right with my account so you will get this prompts uh, you just enter your email address you can enter any email address it's not recommended i mean it's not uh, required to uh, enter only microsoft or any but it's better to use microsoft or any gmail or other accounts so once you in the setup account and then add it will ask some basic information phone number company size and other stuffs just give all this information here and then send the verification code to your phone and then uh, uh, once you verify with your code then add a domain for your trial right 
if if you represent uh, or business organizations your name will be added before on dot microsoft dot com right if you put the domain name like anything like for for me uh, I have shown you right so it was showing something like that if you open this and it will actually it shows me yeah right so I have given the domain name this pokenet and it's added to the uh, MDM uh, on Microsoft.com right so if you give the name so I have given the first name is MDM sec the last name I have given this one so whatever you want you can give it this will be the global administrator okay so uh, let's skip get into the end. so you see here um, create a business identity if you give the name right and then if your organization its own custom domain that you want to use of course every organization has the custom domain name so you can change that in the Microsoft admin describe in the article as well right so you can add the username and make sure you know down of username and password right and review the trial agreement and everything so it's very simple uh, after your account has been created you will see the username and you can use the log into the uh, Intune tenant as well so now how you can and then and then this email actually confirm your subscription is active I will show you how the email actually look like so if I open uh, my Gmail uh, let's go to the TechChamp okay and I will show you I have just signed up a few minutes ago and you will get this email uh, get started with Microsoft into trial subscriptions so this is a trial and uh, you see here the user ID they have given name which I have mentioned here and the user ID like this account informations they have given I have given the organization name service is and subscription start date and end date okay so this is the email you will get as soon as you sign up uh, uh, from here okay now since you already have the sign in into the portal so now you what you have to do you have to open a browser and open this URL in the address bar so this is the Microsoft uh, endpoint uh, manager URL previously we call Intune as you see I landed and it automatically single sign on okay so once you uh, use the user ID which is actually given the user ID will look similar like uh, this one which we have created since I have already signed in so uh, uh, it's already signed in and then you have to confirm the MDM authority in the Microsoft endpoint manager as well so from where you'll get if you have not sign in just uh, just go to here right and then and then you'll see the tenant administration and under the tenant administration you see the MDM authority since this is trial in the trial uh, I have not signed for the company and uh, that's why it's uh, it's not giving options to change it so uh, but if you uh, this is the so you have to set this authority as well so from where you can set the MDM authority I will show you uh, in uh, if you open the if you open the Microsoft Azure portal right and then inside the Azure portal uh, if you go mo mobility right mobility in MDM you see the Microsoft Intune has been set there uh, uh, MDM authority you can get a free premium uh, free uh, premium trial to use this feature right so you see here if you would like to purchase subscription directly from Microsoft you can do this right free trial you can activate this right so I'm just activating EMS okay so it got activated and let's refresh this piece okay and you can add the application as well right so there are many applications are you see Microsoft Intune I have selected you can select any of these MDM so uh, <coughs> After signing into the Microsoft, you'll see the orange banner, right? That you haven't set the MD MDM authority. You can uh, activate at this time. So the MDM authority will be set before user can enroll any devices, right? So this is the 
the uh, the most critical i mean the pre 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 requirement right so uh, like this one and you can set this md routine if you have a configuration manager right if you are using accm you can select this and have a plan to use the co management to manage window your windows 10 devices then and uh, you can uh, you can uh, use that without configuration config accm as well so uh, then then you don't need to select the config manager okay so this is the actually and this is the uh, custom domain name if you want for every organization has its own its has own custom domain that you want to use with on microsoft.com so you can change it from the um, admin center as as well right and 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 you know may, most importantly you cannot remove or rename the initial on dot microsoft.com as a part of domain name so you can add and verify the custom domain name with intune but but you cannot uh, rename or remove this on dot microsoft.com okay so how uh, how you can add in domain just uh, open uh, this right and then uh, if you click on the setups sorry sorry so all and then if you go to if you go to the settings and domain right so this is the uh, i mean you need to open admin.microsoft.com and go to the settings domain and you see i have added you can add your domain here right so like and then you have to verify with domain right as as a global admin so I suppose if you, if you click on any any of the domain name add this domain and connect to the domain and then finish so this is the actually uh, the the requirement you see th this one is already added and you can buy the domain here of course uh, if you have multiple domain you can add it here right so it's uh, instruction is also any and then confirm your license right so a part of trial license you will also have the trial e ems enterprise mobility subscription included in both azure radian premium and the admin experience so this is the portal where you can explore all the capabilities of uh, Intune. This is the where the admin work with Intune. So remember this 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 URL, uh, endpoint dot endpoint dot Microsoft dot com, and this is the Microsoft 365 admin dot Microsoft where you can add and manage users if you are not using Azure Active Directory. So you can also manage other aspect of. Uh, so in the in this video actually I have uh, shown you how you can set up the test environment. For more information, I will. I will uh, s show you how you can create the users and group and then assign the uh, assign the rules to that and then and then I will set up the tenant as well till then thank you bye bye have a good day